Okay, this video is a response to um, the iPhone 4 SIM card hack. Basically, today I'm going to be showing you a more effective way of cutting your SIM card. Um, in this video, I'm going to use this tool, a micro SIM cutter. Uh, I got it online for about 15 bucks. Move the back. Alright, so right here. I have four things of SIM cards. I have a T-Mobile SIM, I have some cut micro SIMs, what's left, and some AT&T SIMs. I guess in this video I'll do an AT&T SIM because I have a lot of them, just to show you. Alright, so there's my iPhone 4, it's my iPad Touch. I'm going to get this tool, one second, get a SIM card. AT&T Alright, so basically you just get this SIM cutter you put in the SIM make sure it's in the bottom it's safe and secure at the bottom and just this your own micro sim check it out here's what's left basically you can use this as an adapter for if you still want to use your sim for any other phone so here we are with the micro sim cut a little of the gold part will get cut off but it seems to still work in the iPhone 4 so here, let's go to the phone. Alright, here's my original micro sim. You can tell it's AT&T. And the one I just made. You can tell they're a little different. Actually, when you're putting the new one in, it's going to fit a little tight because the SIM cutter, I guess, doesn't have it 100% accurate, but it keeps it tight in and so it won't fall out. So here it is. Again, I'm going to put it in. As you can see, I mean, it's going to say no service, it's a blank SIM, but it doesn't say no SIM. So, the phone reads the SIM, if you have a T-Mobile, I'll show you here, I'll show you what happens when you put a T-Mobile SIM in. It actually says the carrier menu comes up, and it's really weird because this is the American version of the iPhone 4, it's not unlocked. It's not SIM free. But here, I'm going to put the T Mobile micro SIM in and I'll show you what happens. As you can see, here it is. You know, cut perfectly. Nice and accurate with the SIM cutter. Alright, here we go. Those bars. When you get it, and there you go, the carrier menu comes up. This is the iPhone 4. It's the American AT&T version. And you go here, and it says unable to load network list. Now, I don't know if it's, you know, on accident, or they just forgot that, you know, to take the menu off. But uh, my opinion is, I think, because AT&T thought they were the only ones that were going to have micro SIMs. Well, of course, we're always going to get around things, but... Yeah, basically the carrier menu comes up. I don't have service on the SIM card, so I don't know if it would actually work. So if anyone would volunteer and make a video response to this with their T-Mobile SIM, that'd be awesome because, I mean, for some reason this phone seems to be unlocked, but it's not. There's not even a jailbreak. So that was basically my review on this and my micro SIM. Thank you.